Before reaping the rewards of a successful date night, hey, you as a man, you gotta put in the work, player. See, a lot of men these days, they want the rewards of being a man, but only want the responsibilities of a young child. In other words, they want some good old loving from the girl, but don't actually wanna take the time to plan out a nice night to make her feel special. So with Valentine's Day coming up, one of the biggest nights of the year, today I'll be discussing how you can achieve a very successful date night. So before discussing any grooming and styling tips, let's go ahead and dive into the preparation phase. Now, since this pandemic started last year, it's kind of thrown off our you know, normal daily routines. So if you're planning on taking your girl out to her favorite restaurant, set a reservation, number one, because everybody's probably got the same idea. And number two, with social distancing, most restaurants aren't occupying all their tables. So the waiting time to get a table is even longer because there's less availability. And the last thing you want is you and your date waiting two to three hours just to get a table. Instead, the goal would be just to show up and while everybody else is waiting for the tables, you just walk right in like a G with your date and come up in there like you own the place. Now, if you're staying indoors like a lot of us are doing, I would highly encourage you to make your date her favorite meal. There's plenty of recipes that you can follow on Pinterest or what my wife and I usually like to do, it's kind of like our little Valentine's tradition is order a heart-shaped pizza from Pizza Hut. It's kind of a cute little deal, you know, like a little nice surprise for your girl when she opens the box and any pizza place should be able to do this really as long as you call beforehand or request it or you can simply just make a heart shaped entree yourself. As far as gifts go, no worries, I got you guys covered. In my opinion, there's nothing more personal than actually creating something with your own hands. Now, I do have a Pinterest board that you can check out down in the description that has all my personal favorite DIY gifts. I've pretty much done all these myself and my wife absolutely loved all of them. So no worries, you know, these things have been tested. And if you're not too much into DIY type of stuff, you can always make a short video with some kind of little love message in it. My wife did this for me actually a couple years back and Ooh, I, I adored it. So once you got your night kind of laid out, planned out, you know exactly what you're gonna give her, you know you got everything under control, you know you're gonna have yourself a great night and you're gonna absolutely just kill it. And obviously, her engines more than likely are gonna be revving at this point, right? And uh, hey, we've talked about this before, men, feel most valued and loved when they're having sex, but women are kind of opposite. They want sex when they're feeling most valued and loved. So if you're doing your job right and you're genuinely making her feel valued, then it's time to prepare your little soldier for the lawnmower 3.0 my brothers. Now before we move on to all of today's grooming and styling tips, I do want to thank manscaped.com for sponsoring today's video. We got a crazy, crazy deal for all of you today. Of course, Valentine's Day is one of the most important days of the year, and more than ever, this is the day where you as a man need to be on point from head to toe and everything in between. You definitely don't want to be caught with a Harry Richard going on. No, sir. Oh, baby. You ready for this? Oh. What? Can I... Can I just, uh, um... Yeah, sure, I guess. Okay, now you can do me. <laughs> and another step you don't want to miss is smelling the part. Cologne is a key indicator that a man takes care of himself and it's very alluring when a man has his own signature scent. We know this, and of course, when planning for a date night, you want something that smells sexy, seductive, and the refined cologne by Manscaped will provide you with just that. And today, exclusively for you guys, we're offering 20% off, plus two free gifts, plus free shipping, a deal you don't wanna miss out on. So be sure to get your hands on this awesome cologne and get it just in time before Valentine's Day, and also be sure to check out the performance package that has all your grooming essentials, including the Lawnmower 3.0. Moving on, moisturize and hydrate. Now, Valentine's Day, of course, is gonna be involving some serious physical touch, so uh, three main things that you really wanna focus on is your hands. Now, if you're a married dude like me, your hands are gonna be hunka hunka all over the place doing their thing, you know? So you gotta make sure that your hands are turning her on rather than turning her off and making her skin feel itchy and raw. So for this, you could either go for some sort of hand cream or what I like to personally do is mix some oil and lotion together. This is kind of a little hack that gives you some amazing soft skin. Of course, your face should be nice and smooth and moisturized, your lips as well. And if you've got a beard, make sure those whiskers are nice and smooth, especially if you're gonna be doing that thing all up in between, if you know what I mean. And hey, make sure that your hair is on point. According to online surveys, 
Women love men with messy, smooth hair. Me personally, what I've been doing lately is washing my hair only using the activating oil cleanser, which is pretty much like a healthy shampoo that'll never strip your hair of its natural oils. And I've also been using my friend Mike's grooming oil that he actually made himself. This thing, it smells just fantastic. Out of this world amazing. I'm actually, I'm, I'm kind of jealous of how amazing his products smell, just to be honest with you. But anyways, with those two products, this combo has been making my hair feel crazy soft lately. And to style my hair, I have been using Pomade, which is a new product by my brand, Shavu. And rather than combing my hair all perfectly into place, I've been going for a more finger combed, messy slick back, as any hairstyle that involves a more messy, sexy appeal is definitely gonna give off a more sexy, seductive vibe. And by the way, for any of you looking for some discounts, on these men's hairstyling products, I'll be sure to put some promo codes down in the description below for you. As far as dress code, hey, you guys, you guys already know the deal. You guys know how to dress yourselves. However, if you are staying at home, um, don't neglect dressing nice. I mean, just because you're at home doesn't mean you can just get away with rocking a tank top with some basketball shorts. What I would encourage you to do, and what I'm gonna personally do myself, is yes, dress comfy, but still play the part, you know? Uh, uh, wear something, you know, casual, some sort of sweatsuit would even be cool. Something that's not only comfy for you, but for her as well. Comfy enough for her to, uh, you know, cuddle up with you on the couch. Set the mood, make sure your house is immaculate. Uh, uh, you know, light those candles, turn that fireplace on, uh, turn on some nice music even. Honestly, I feel like this is pretty common sense, but uh, hey, gotta make sure we cover it. There's some of you dudes out there still, man, that just, uh, you need some help, so hey got you. Uncle Dre's got you. A quick tip that's probably the most important one in today's video that you should take with you for the rest of your life is eyes here, my brother. Look, I can't tell you how many friends of mine that are girls that always tell me when they're out on dates, their dude is always looking at the other girl passing by, rubbernecking. Bruh. It's a shame, my dude, and um, this is something that all of us men need to practice on daily, is keeping our eyes right here focused on our woman. I know there's a lot of beautiful looking people out there in the world, my brothers, but hey, that's no excuse. I'm sure you wouldn't appreciate your girl looking at, you know, every dude passing by, so uh, we need to make sure that we are keeping this in mind and that we're, you know, doing the same. Now, whether you're going out or you're staying at home, plan for a tech-free evening. Put the phone away. Um, my dad always said growing up, the most important person in the whole world is the one right in front of you. So give your full attention to your date, especially on this night, Valentine's Day, and uh, make sure that they feel like the most important person in the world, like the only person in the world. Keep that phone away. Now, if you consider yourself a gentleman, I would highly encourage you to always have some body oil on deck. Now look, lotion is cool. It's, it's, it's cool for, you know, giving massages. It'll get the job done, but body oil. Ooh, if you, if you really wanna prove that you are a cut above the rest, some body oil, this'll do it, my brothers. Ultimately, no woman is ever going to deny a nice body massage. And so if you really wanna get her engines revved up hey this is a pretty sweet little little hack little shortcut for you and to close this sucker out just make sure that you are well rested the night before this is a big day you know this is uh you want to treat this like your first date make sure that you're sharp that you're well rested that you're feeling good feeling energized looking energized i would even down an energy drink or some coffee beforehand you know, do something this way you can just give her a nice special night make her feel special women hey look women are a beautiful gift from god they deserve the best so give them the best at the end of the day a woman no matter what age she is a woman wants to be treated like a princess she wants to feel like a princess what happens when uh have you ever seen a, a little girl walk into maybe you have a sister i don't know whatever maybe you have a friend that has kids have you ever seen a little girl run into the room and, and run up to her daddy in her little Cinderella dress or whatever and look up to her dad and say, Daddy, Daddy, how do I look? Oh, you look amazing, sweetheart. You look absolutely beautiful, stunning. And so that little girl at that point, that little girl is always in a woman, no matter what age they are, you know, no matter how old they get, they always want to be treated like a princess. They want to feel like a princess. So be their prince, show up, man, be their prince. With that said, I hope you all got a little something from this video, and um, I hope you guys have a wonderful Valentine's Day, and 
and I look forward to talking to you all very soon. Until next time, my name is Dre Drexler. Peace always.